I'd want to be the fattest woman in the world. I, I'm not going to help you do it, but I still love you no matter what. I believe in you. <laughs> Weighing 700 pounds, Supersized model Monica is morbidly obese, but she's got no plans to lose weight. The ultimate goal is to be a thousand pounds, to be able to take up an entire seat like this one. I'd want to be the fattest woman in the world and become immobile. What attracts me to being immobile is you get to be like a queen. Like back in the Egyptian ages where like the fatter you were, the more loved you were, I guess. On an average day, I'd probably eat between six and 8,000 calories a day. The 27-year-old has the assistance of boyfriend Sydney. Can you help me? Yeah, no problem. To see Monica getting bigger just makes me feel proud because she's achieving what she wants to do. <laughs> I mean, of course, I'm not complaining. I've been into, you know, fat girls ever since I was, <laughs> I've been into girls, so, you know, I'm definitely not complaining. Get the milk out. So right now we are going to make a weight gain shake. Basically I take strawberry Pop-Tarts. She likes strawberry Pop-Tarts. Heavy cream, ice cream, and 2% milk. Just blend it all together. Helping Monica pile on even more pounds, Sydney often funnel feeds her. Um, I started funnel feeding when I met Sid. Sid encourages me because, you know, it's my goal and he wants to help me reach my goal. All right, babe, you ready to funnel? Okay. All right, you gotta let me know when you've had enough, okay? I believe in you. Oh my god. I feel so good. I feel like I'm in heaven right now. My belly is really like, I mean, I'm still gonna eat more food, but <laughs> it's full right now. And I just, I'm like, really turned on right now as well. <laughs> yeah, our sex life is really good. Obviously we can't do every position in the world, but I can get off just by him rubbing my belly button. And it's not just Sydney who takes pleasure in Monica's size. With a huge online following, she can earn as much as $600 for a photo shoot. So this is probably my favorite lingerie for Monica, so we're gonna go put it on and uh, model a little bit. I have what they call feeders. At least once a month, I'll have certain guys that will just send me money for food. In return, I'd like send them a video or, you know, pictures of me eating the food or something like that. You know, I'm the one laying next to her at night, not them. And it's her job. It's her body. I'm not gonna tell her what to do with it. Smile for me. Big smile. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Before the couple got together, Monica's stepbrother Joseph, who's 15 years old, helped her with her shoots. I was actually her photographer for a little while. It, it really made her happy because she's always wanted to be a model. It did feel strange a little bit at first, but after a little, a little bit of getting used to, I, it, it just felt normal because I mean, for some people, actually a lot of people, it's really abnormal to see someone of her size. But for me, she's always been around me my entire life. While the couple's exploits are well known online, Monica's mother, Terry, is in the dark over the extent of her daughter's ambition. Hey, Sid. Monica's in the bedroom. She's kind of stuck right now, so come on in. Okay. Hey, Monica. Sit down, please. You know how Sid likes to feed me like a lot of food? 
Okay. Okay. The ultimate goal is to like be like a thousand pounds. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's what makes me happy. To not be able to take care of yourself? Well... Even at my weight, it's miserable. Sometimes I just... I just want to go to the gym and just... Wish I could just run until all the weight's gone. Um, it's your life if that's what makes you happy. I, I'm not going to help you do it. I still... <clears throat> I'm still going to worry about you. <sighs> it hurts my heart to know <clears throat> that she doesn't want to live a happy life. Or to me, it's not happy. Obviously, she's upset, and it's understandable. But overall, I think it went okay. I I love being big and I love modeling and it's just what, what, what I love. She's already obese. I see the struggles in her day-to-day -day life now. So to imagine her being bigger than she is now. 91 inches. It's very hard for me. It's very hard to imagine that. There you go. Close to 100. <laughs> I am worried about her health, but um, ultimately it's her body, it's her choice, not mine. If, even if I'm not here, she's gonna, she's gonna do it. And, you know, I love her, so I'm gonna help her out however I can. Monica was once slimming to be eligible for weight loss surgery after an ex-boyfriend made negative comments about her size. He would pretty much push me to lose weight. I was only eating 500 calories a day. Losing weight did not make me happy at all. I was supposed to have my surgery. I realized I couldn't go through with it. What I like about the way Monica looks is that she's just soft and squishy and cuddly and I'm in love with her. I love the fact that she's a gamer. You know, I love playing video games too. So um, that gives us definitely something to, uh, to bond over. Yeah. We've talked about having children, and if we ever did, uh, we would definitely hire help, like a nanny or something. Me and Sid have uh, conceived a baby before, as a matter of fact, twice, and I miscarried both times. If the doctor told me in order for me to have a baby, I would have to lose weight, I think I'd honestly probably lose weight. The things I'm looking forward to getting bigger is that there's just going to be more of it, like, everywhere. They actually make beds with, like, areas that you can actually use the restroom, and Sid would help me clean up and stuff. If Sid ever left, that would, that would suck. It would be, like, impossible, I guess. I'm pretty sure I can find another man, like, instantly, but... Just the fact that I love Sid, you know, it's like... If that's how she wants to be with her life, is to be immobile, and it makes her happy, then so be it. There's not much I can change. Anybody can die at any time. You know, it doesn't matter if you're fat or skinny or whatever. I'm always gonna love you. I'm always gonna love you too. This is my life, and this is the way I want to live it. 